Barack, what the heck is this game? Ah, uh, Trump, this game is called Overcooked. It's a game about cooking in a restaurant. First, Joe wanted to play that duck game, and now you want to play a cooking game. What's next? A train game? Donald, just chill out. This game is so fun. Now, connect your controller so you can play with me. Bro, give me a second! Sounds like someone needs their pacifier. Oh my goodness me! You can make soup in this game. That's so fun. Shut up, Joe. Everyone knows how to make soup. It's the most generic thing ever. Trump, join the game! It's literally starting as we speak. Oh, frick! My controller! It just blew up into a million pieces! Are you okay, Daddy? Do I need to send Mommy to help you out? Shut up! I'm gonna beat the living frick out of you! Joseph, since your dad can't join, you will have to join me. Oh, I don't know where I put my controller. Oh, wait! I had it up in there. What the heck? Guys, I have bad news. For some reason, my controller isn't working. I think it might have had to do with the fact that it was up my- Stop it right there. Okay, both of you are stupid. What are the chances that you guys do the stupidest things to break your controllers? Dude, all I did was press the on button and then it blew up. Oh, wow, you're cutting onions. I can't believe it's not butter. All right, you definitely said some sort of racist joke. Can you explain the racist joke to me? That wasn't a racist joke. I was just saying, I can't believe it's not butter. No joke there, dog. Mommy, don't cut your hands with the chopper thingy. Biden, it's a game. I'm not going to cut my hands with anything. Also, I am not your mommy. Barack, doesn't soup take more than just three onions to deem it a good tasting soup and a soup in general? I mean, aren't there a lot more ingredients than just three onions? Yes, but this is a game, so I don't need anything more than just three onions. Oh, I love onions. Keep cooking up some of that onion soup, Blackie. I'm gonna beat the living hell out of you if you don't shut the hell up right now. Oh, Barack, you have to do dishes now. Wow, the woman is finally in the kitchen doing her job. Shut your mouth. Oh, frick, I need to clean this plate. <laughs> I knew you were about to do that. Hey, Mom, while you're there, can you clean my baby cup? Daddy didn't want to clean it out for me. Joe, for the last time, this is a video game. Everything in here is all fake. Oh, frick. I can't do everything at once. Trump, call up the Amazon guy to deliver you a controller. I can't serve all these customers by myself. Bro, grow a pair. You can do this without the help of the biggest D, Trump. Yeah, listen to Trump. After all, he is your ex-husband. Shut the hell up. I have never married a man before, nor have I had any relations with one. All right, let's just bring out Exhibit A. You and a man named Larry Sinclair. He said that you had a drug filled and- You better shut it. That guy is just a crackhead looking for some attention. Barack, we get it. You don't want to say what happened on that night in 99 because it's too inappropriate to be said in this video. There is nothing to be said. Everything that comes out of that buffoon's mouth is not true. Now let's focus on the game. Hey, Barack, I think there are some people waiting on their onion soup. You might want to fill those orders before they get mad. You're an idiot, Joe. I literally can see that. Do you think I'm blind or something? You know what? Don't answer that because you're gonna say something stupid. I don't say anything that is stupid. I only say things that are smart because I am as smart as Ben. That nerd is an idiot. Both of you probably have the same IQ level due to how you act. Oh, Barrack, it looks like you got less than 50 seconds left. I wouldn't be surprised if you lost this game just like you lost to Larry in a beer pong game. For the last time, I have no affiliation with that man. Also, I see that, Dumbo. Cut the onions, Obama. Cut them faster than you cut ties with Mr. Sinclair after the 99 incident. Shut your before I come over there and rip your mouth off your face. You can't do that because you're making soup for the hangry customers. Yeah, stay in the kitchen, woman. Michelle, Trump and Joe want to tell you something. Can you come here for a second? Hold up, we're just joking. We are not sexist at all. That's what I thought. Uh, oh shoot, I'm gonna lose. Come on, mommy, you can get this last order. Go, mommy. It's not letting me put it in the bowl. Frick this game, I'm gonna freaking blow a gasket. Oh, you identify as a car? I got you. Oh, shut the hell up. Let's just see if my big mommy won. Oh, hell yeah, I got three stars. <laughs> and you were saying that I was going to lose turnip. How in the hell did you get three star? You had so many unfulfilled orders. Trump, it doesn't matter how many orders were unfulfilled. What matters is the order's time running out. Because when it does that, it will bring my score down. Thanks for the rundown, doofus. Oh, Obama, your kitchen is in the middle of the road. A car is going to drive right through it. Run, Barack. There are no cars. They, they shut down this road so we can sell some food. Crud, where the hell is the onions? Did that guy not leave us any? Ha, 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 ha. This is actually too funny. Barack, I think you need to open your eyes. The hell do you mean? I've looked everywhere and can't seem to find this freaking onion thing. Joseph, do you see the thing that I see? Oh yeah, I can see the kid that is crossing the road. Barack, you should sniff them for me. Hell no, nah. I ain't no pedo Pete like you. Trump, where the frick is it? Barack, you just gotta look a bit closer at the countertops. I think you'll be flattered to find out where it actually is. I'll be flattered? What? Oh my freaking gosh, you're kidding me right now. <laughs> I can't. Dude, you're actually so blind. How did you not see that from the start? 
I don't know. Wait, I put a freaking plate over it. I'm such an idiot. Barack, you don't have to tell all of us what we already know. Yeah, it's okay to be an idiot, Mama. Joseph, you sound like an idiot all the time. You have no right to talk, you immature little brat. I am not a brat. I am a big kid now, Mommy. I, my stuff is gonna burn. Stop distracting me. Hey, Frick. Miss Hussein, I think you're cooking this stuff pretty slowly. Maybe you should pick up the pace a bit. Donald, I am going as fast as I can. You can't say nothing because you ain't even playing the game. Look, I've cooked some food before and I can confidently say that you're as slow as your unalived grandma. Oh, let me guess. You microwaved a Hot Pocket? That isn't cooking, bro. For your information, it wasn't a Hot Pocket. It was a three-course gourmet meal. That's bull. I would have heard of this if it actually happened. And besides, if you can cook, then why don't you do that instead of door dashing some McDonald's? Well, um, I don't ever feel like doing that. DoorDash is way better. Leave it to Donnie to be lazy. Boys, are you seeing this amazing productivity? I'm going faster than Ramsey ever could. The productivity is so good that you're about to miss an order. No, I ain't. That order will be fulfilled before you can even say I will resign from the presidency. Hey, Joseph, you should say that to see if he's lying. I will resign from the presidency. Oh, man, he did do it before I finished saying it. Joseph, since you resigned, who are you going to give the presidency to? Oh, I'll just give it to Trump since he just offered me a free vacation to Mar-a-Lago through messages. Guys, did I tell you about how annoying this game is when you're playing by yourself? Obama, stop your crying. We get that you don't have a big and strong man to help you out in the kitchen. <laughs> Mommy, are you okay? It sounds like you're choking on the long john again. Listen here, you two idiots. I am not a woman, nor am I a mother. I'm the father of two beautiful daughters. I am married to a great woman, and I never had any relations with a man in 99. Trump, you're probably a woman, and Joseph, you probably had relations with that man in 99. Thanks for reminding me, Barack. I completely forgot that I was invited to Larry's house in 99. My bad, Daddy. Hussein, I think you're going delusional or something. At first, you said that you were a man. Then you said that you were a woman. Then a car. And now a father. I'm going to ignore you because I'm going to run out of time. Go, Barack, go. You're about to have an unfulfilled order. You better go faster. <sighs> Frick. Frick. I hate that these things start to overcook so fast. <laughs> Come on. You're going to miss an order. You're going to miss an order. I am not going to miss an order. Just watch my amazing maneuvers and cooking skills. You got less than 30 seconds left. Who's <laughs> Oh, crud, stop overcooking. Yes, it's ready. Barack, you're gonna miss it. Why? Watch this. I got this in the bag, boys. Ha 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 ha. Got him. There are 10 seconds left and there's another order unfulfilled. I don't have time. Let's just hope it doesn't run out of time before the real timer goes out. Oh no, the timer. Ah. All right, yeah, let's just see the scores. I think you'll get three. Yeah, you did it, Obama. This is rigged. The game was supposed to give you zero stars because of the slowness. I was going fast the whole freaking time. I don't want to hear the jealousy, you carrot. Shut the hell up. Hey, do you guys want to play again soon? I'll make sure to get a controller for next time. Hell yeah. I'm going to show Obama how to really go fast. Thanks to everyone on screen for becoming a member. Also, thanks for watching.